Good afternoon, everybody. Well, I won't beat around the bush. Ben, you were the team leader for this bloody shambles. Why should I not fire you? Sir Alan, I've got so much to offer you. I really have got the raw business talent to be your next apprentice. I've shown that I'm an absolute grafter. So I'll get my I'll get my hands started. I've shown that I'm very good at sales. Uh, I, I've shown that I'm a good team leader, uh, even if this has been turned around on me now. Okay, okay. I've heard enough. You were meant to go out and sell Christmas trees. And don't give me the excuse that it was in June. I'm fed up with all your excuses. You managed to sell 20, so who sold them? I did, Sir Alan. All of them. Very well done, Deborah. So what makes you so bleeding special? Well, Sir Alan, I have read a book called Empathy Selling, and this helped me to identify the different type of traits people are made up of. By understanding people, I was able to sell to their key desires. Sir Alan, did you know that each person is made up of seven key characteristics? We have two to three dominant ones, and the rest balance up our personality. No, I bloody well don't. So what sort of characteristics do I have then? Well, Sir Alan, your dominant trait would be a politician. They say you can always tell a politician, but you can never tell a politician anything. True bloody right you can't tell me anything. I know it all. There is only room for one big mouth in my company, and that's me. Mary Poppins, I am not. Tell me, Deborah, since you're so bloody clever, what is Ben? Well, Sir Alan, Ben is a double checker and a normal, which means he's always asking for help, but won't want to rock the boat. So, what do you say about that then, Ben? Well, I think the things that are important to consider are that I can compete at a world-class level. I've had an army scholarship to Sandhurst. You keep going on about bloody Sandhurst. I was in the Jewish Lads Brigade, Stanford Hill Division, trainee bugler, and that did not help me sell computers. Okay, Deborah. This book sounds interesting, so what's it going to do for me? Well, Sir Alan, if you ask all of your apprentices to fill in the online questionnaire that's on the empathyselling.com website, you would be able to identify their key personality traits, and you would know if they're suitable for this job. Plus, the book tells you how to communicate with difficult to handle people like you. So, what you're saying is, I've wasted 10 bloody weeks doing this bleeding apprentice thing. If I had understood how people were made up first and then selected the apprentices from that, it would have saved me a whole lot of time and money. Yes, Sir Alan, that's exactly right, Sir Alan. Bloody hell, I'm fired.